I am 81 years of age and have almost a billion citizens. I've been in office 62 years, the longest serving monarch in history. <clears throat> have we finished? Mr. Kareem, you will travel to England. You will serve the Queen. But whatever you do, you must not look at Her Majesty. There's another famine in India and more trouble in Ireland. Prime Minister, you really are terribly depressing. Yes. Jelly, Your Majesty. <laughs> I suddenly feel a great deal better. How do you like your new Scottish costumes? They're very scratchy. Everything in Scotland is scratchy. <laughs> What can they be talking about? What is a the mango? The queen of fruit. I would like a mango. They only grow in India. Well, I'm empress of India, so I have one cent. I thought she was supposed to be dying. No one really knows what it's like to be queen. Bertie. Mother. Are you spying on me? I'm so lonely. What is the point, Abdul? So is your majesty. I would like Mr. Abdul to teach me. But he's an Indian, Your Majesty. And I am the Queen of England. I will have whatever help I require. You've upset the order of everything. Mother, you are bringing the monarchy to crisis. Prime Minister. Your Majesty. You will drop this Indian peasant, or we will have you certified insane. I am cantankerous, greedy, ill-tempered and disagreeably attached to power. But I am anything but insane. How dare you look down on Abdul? I am Queen of England. I am Empress of India. But most importantly, I am a servant to a billion citizens. Abdul has risen on his own merits. He too was a servant. Now, he is my friend. I haven't been as happy as this for years. A gift from the Indian Empire. What is it? A mango. It's off. Sir Henry, this mango is off.